everyone. I'm Jackie with 360 Alberta. And as you can see, we're not going to get those motorcycles out any time too soon. So I want to take this opportunity to introduce to you Jay Padella from Cycle Works. Let me tell you a little bit about Jay. First and foremost, he's a guy who likes to ride motorcycles. He likes to play outdoors and he loves the open road. It's about the destination, getting from A to B. Whether it's in the rain or the snow or the bright sunshine, it's all about the ride. Jay is a partner with Cycle Works. He's been with them for 19 years and what has struck him the most is that his customers over the past 19 years have become his friends. They do things together. Cycle Works itself has been around for 40 years. It started as a machine shop. Don Galloway built uh, on the grassroots and it was his love for the sport that has led them to five retail locations. And most of Cycle Works customers are from rural Alberta. One of Jay's favorite charity events that he works on uh, and for 12 years he's worked on it, is the Kids with Cancer Revving Up Ride. Uh, the group has raised a pile of money over the 15 years. As a matter of fact, they've raised over $3 million. And uh, it just makes the hair on your arm stand up just to think about what they've done. It's a four-day motorcycle venture. Uh, folks from Calgary and Edmonton ride together, and uh, it's so well organized. You pull into the gas station, someone's there to pump your gas, your food is waiting for you, your room is waiting for you at night. But the best part is everyone riding together. And they also get to bring a family along with them who is going through uh, cancer treatments. And uh, as Jay says, he's had the opportunity to watch some of those children uh, grow up and ride with them as all. So that's, uh, you can find that on kidswithcancer.ca. It's one of their signature events. Another event that Jay is actively involved in is the Edmonton Toy Run. Uh, to Jay, it is so frustrating when 25 to 30,000 children each year do not have the opportunity to celebrate Christmas the way that you and I do. So together with hundreds of other bikers bringing an unwrapped toy for Santa's Anonymous, this group um, comes together. It's the la almost the last ride of the year and uh, they bring a toy for a deserving child. Jay's taken his children to go out and deliver the toys and it is an experience that they will never forget. Jay's current project is called the 14 day show and shine. When the pandemic hit, he reached out to the, to the people that he knew to check out how they were doing and if they needed anything, anything that was except toilet paper. Uh, lots offered their help to him. And he found that in this time of horribleness, customers and clients did reach out and asked him what he needed more than what he could do for them. Well, he thought, you can't ride right now, but how do you bring everybody's inputs together? Jay asked them to send pictures of their rides, and he received hundreds of pictures. The 14-day show and shine could go on all year and even beyond. It was a great way to bring friends together, friends that he perhaps even lost connection with. And uh, they got to show where they had ridden their bikes, and as Jay said, we will all ride again. The photos are an opportunity to remember the person who is in the photo, the fun times they had together, and the fact that you can't wait to do it all over again. You can reach Jay at J Padella, P A D I L L A, so letter J P A D I L L A, at cycleworks.com. He found it to be amazing and a humbling experience to get the responses that he did get. As Jay said, he started his kids young, and as long as you're geared up properly, uh, you, when you start, you become a rider for life. That's Jay Padella, and his great uh, escape right now during our time of isolation, and that happens to be the 14-day show and shine. You can catch that on Facebook. I'm Jackie, and this is 360 Alberta, and one day we will ride again.